We are Onyx Imaging. We are the highest rated and most reviewed printer service center in Oklahoma. Hi, my name is John with Onyx Imaging. Today we're going to take a look at this HP LaserJet M608 printer, and then we're going to look at some common causes of paper jams. More specifically, we're going to look at common causes of paper jams that happen because of issues inside of your paper tray. So the first thing I want to do is go ahead and remove our paper tray. I'm also going to go ahead and remove the paper from the inside of the paper tray so we can get a better look at the inside. So if I tilt this up, you'll see there's three adjusting tabs on the inside of this paper tray. And what those are for is to adjust this paper tray for the exact size paper you're using in this paper tray. So if you look along the bottom of the paper tray, there's several different settings for different size pieces of paper. And it's very, very important that you have all these adjusting tabs set on the correct setting for the size paper you're using in this paper tray. So in our case, we're using a standard eight and a half by 11 or letter paper. So we wanna make sure that all of our indications, or all of the indicators are set on the proper indication at the bottom of the paper tray. Now, there, the, there's a couple of different issues that come from it. One, if you have them set for a different size piece of paper, it's not gonna allow the paper to fit inside the paper tray correctly, which is gonna cause issues for the printer to pull the paper properly. So very, very important they have it set correctly. It could also cause some confusion where the printer is looking for a different size piece of paper, even if it does pull the paper, and they can still give you paper jam errors. So just really, really important. Make sure you have all of your indicators set properly for the size piece of paper you're using in this paper tray. Now another thing we see quite frequently comes from adding paper into the printer. So what happens is you end up getting low on, on paper, you, add, you go grab another stack, and you go to add it in, and as you set the paper down and kind of push it back, what will happen is it'll push a couple sheets back, and then it'll get kind of curled up in the back of the paper tray. So what happens then is it kind of pinches the paper inside the paper tray and gives you a lot of paper jam issues. So very, very important. Whenever you add paper into the paper tray, just take a quick second and just visually check all four sides. Make sure you don't see any paper curled up anywhere. It's a nice, clean, even stack. That's going to go a long way as far as reducing the amount of paper jams you're getting. And then another thing is if you look on the two side adjusting tabs that we looked at earlier, you'll see a little piece of plastic that points inward towards the tray. And what those are for is those are show you the maximum amount of paper you can fit inside this paper tray. So you never want to feel past that line or try to force paper below it. What'll happen is it'll cause paper to be way too tight up against the paper pickup assembly inside the printer, causing issues with it pulling paper properly. And you're gonna end up with a lot of paper jams. So very important. I would actually say it's an even better idea to leave a small gap between your top sheet of paper and these little maximum fill lines here. Again, that'll go a long, long way as far as reducing the amount of paper jams you're getting. Now, if you've tried all three of those and you're still getting consistent paper jams, there's a good chance that your rollers are getting worn and need to be serviced or replaced. And if that's the case, please feel free to give Onyx a call and we'd love to help take care of that for you. Also, if there's any way we can help supply with any of your printer office supply needs, please feel free to reach out to Onyx. We'd love to help supply those for you as well. We hope you have a great day and you're back up and printing. Thank you. Thank you for watching. If you're interested in how you can receive free labor on all of your service calls, as well as how to qualify for free printer upgrades, contact us today. We are here for all of your printer and office supply needs.